second and final day of New Zealand Bloodstock's ready to run sale of two-year-olds concluded with a bang here at Caracca. With fierce competition throughout the day, figures have topped last year's record break in sale. With 31 fewer horses catalogued compared with last year, the sale has concluded with a new record turnover of $19,297,500 for 241 horses sold. While the average has reached a new record price of $80,073, the all-important sale median set a new record at $60,000 and the clearance rate was a very pleasing 73%. The action kicked off with the very first lot of the day, lot 201. An outstanding Sabbathville Colt, Queensland trainer John Morrissey going to $350,000 to secure it. All done, I cash him at $350. Thank you, John, you buy him. Sabbathville was to the floor again a couple of hours later, providing the top price of the day when a Colt of his, lot 264, was knocked down to Bryce Hayes of Ellerslie Lodge $460,000. I sell him bidding for $460,000. $460,000 buys outright. Thank you, underbidders. The international presence on the buying bench was notable again today with horses destined for Australia, China, Macau, Hong Kong, Singapore, Malaysia, and Indonesia. While the leading buying nation overall was Australia, the fourth year in a row. The leading buyer for the sale was Singapore-based trainer Michael Clements, who purchased 10 horses for $1.4 million. Back at the ready-to-run sale for the second year was the China Inner Mongolia Rider Horse Group, with 20 lots purchased for $503,500. Regaining their crown as leading vendor was Lyndhurst Farm, who sold 18 lots for $2.6 million, with lot 344 being their top price of $330,000.